Hello YouTube, we're back at GameStop, of course, like I said, at around 9 o'clock they let everybody have their copies. Here's the receipt. Here's the game, Deluxe Edition. I can't believe it, you know, they, uh, I feel, I have kind of feel ripped off in a sense. Because they let some piece of shit walk in and buy a fucking copy of the, how do you call it? It, they, they, went, they let some piece of shit walk in and buy a copy of the freaking standard edition. That right there, no. They said Deluxe and uh, that piece of shit John Cena edition are getting theirs four days early. How the shit did they let, do, do they let some random person walk in and get the standard edition when the standard edition people are supposed to wait till freaking Tuesday? Tell me that. That that right there is a bunch of crap. That was bad. That that they shouldn't be allowing people standard edition right then. No. The deluxe it specifically said the special edition and the deluxe get four day they, they get to play it four days earlier than everybody else. Standard edition is set for ten seventeen, not freaking ten thirteen. That right there, that that's that right there is pretty. It'll piss off a lot of people, because uh, the standard edition shouldn't have been sold to anybody. Right now, the standard edition should have waited until next week. Anyways, yeah, we went off and got it today. Um, I, I I feel ripped off right there though. You know they shouldn't be letting the standard edition people get their damn games early. Uh, -uh that's for freaking deluxe and special edition people. But anyways. Got mine for Xbox One. As I've said before, my gamer tag, and actually my PSN too. So my PSN for PlayStation and my gamer tag for Xbox, both Demon Child CC. Type it in. I'm right there. You can go ahead and add me if you want. But yeah, the deluxe edition. Yeah, of course, hang. No, you guys are tired of me showing it. But anyways, like I say, I like to strip that. Not like cut it off like that. What I do is I do this. Damn, it's a little stubborn. See what I mean? You guys saw me do this on the Marvel vs. Capcom game. But yeah, just rip it off like that. Clean as clean can be. Open this shit up right here. Where we're gonna stick it at. There's all the stuff that it comes with. Guess we'll just go ahead and slap it right there. Yeah, there we go. I don't know. I've always been like that. I know it's kind of pointless to some, but yeah, I've always done that. A second. Hmm. Okay. I'm not seeing much of the special edition stuff that was supposed to come in pre-order bonus. Oh, the pre-order bonuses. Okay. They stuck it all in the deluxe edition pack. Of course, Kurt Angle. Two versions of Kurt Angle. The machine version, as, as far as I like to call him. Or the wrestling machine. And the Olympic gold medalist, Kurt Angle, which actually had hair. The season pass, which entitles you to all the DLC, which, you know, if you buy the game for 60 bucks, this is going to cost you an extra 30 bucks, And you get all those uh, DLC characters right there. Who gives a shit about these two pieces of garbage? But, you know... We get RVD and we get uh, Blue Tista, actually Batista, but we called him Blue Tista because he wore blue that one time. Hey, and check it out, you guys can have that. Penny and I don't already use it, which I'm likely going to use it right now anyways. And there's this, I actually have the game, I actually play this game, so... Hmm, you get one Ultimate Seth Rollins card, three Elite Superstar cards, and uh, one Limited Edition... 2K18 card back. Hmm, okay. That's pretty sick. 
three elites and one ultimate i could use that i could use another ultimate at least but anyways there you have it it'd be nice if they instead of actual male wrestlers because on this game it's a bitch and a half to find female wrestlers so it'd be nice if i got nothing but females for all those or at least two of them but anyways let's get down to it there's really nothing much else to look at actually i was i would have bought it because i would have I would have gotten 20% off at at uh, Best Buy. I would have bought it at Best Buy. Except for the fact that at Best Buy... How do I put it? Best Buy doesn't let you progressively pay off. And at the time, I was thinking about pre-ordering the, the Special Edition. Because I got Special Edition last year. Until they freaking... Kick this right in the freaking damn dick. John Cena, Seen Enough Edition. Who fucking cares? Yeah, I don't... Why? Well, I would not pay $150 for a piece of shit Cena Edition. So I paid in 90 for this edition. Anyways, thanks for watching. We'll see you guys on the next video. Laters.